Right, so I'm Ian Candy and I'm a lecturer in physical geography in the department. And if you decide to come and study at Royal Holloway, I'll be teaching you a lot of physical geography in the first year and also be taking you on our field trip to Spain, which runs in the January of the first year. During our different programmes and different modules at Royal Holloway, what we try and do is get you to think about the way in which the physical environment works, how dynamic it is, how changeable it is, and the way in which humans impact on those environments. During the first year in particular, the physical geography programme is incredibly diverse. Really what we're trying to do is teach you all of the key theories and key ideas in physical geography that we think are important to the subject as it stands at the present day. So we'll be teaching you about the atmosphere, climate, hurricanes, we'll be thinking about the geosphere, that's tectonic processes, volcanoes, earthquakes, surface processes such as glaciers, rivers and coasts. And then we'll be thinking about climate change, climate change over long time periods, climate change over short time periods and how we know whether climate change is natural or whether it's something produced by human processes. A major part of our first year programme is our first year field trip to Spain. We take the entire undergraduate year, so 110 to 120 students, to a small town just to the east of Malaga in Andalusia in southern Spain. In there you have a great opportunity to see geography in action in a region of Europe. Spain is probably one of the best regions in the world to train undergraduates in the key areas of physical geography because there are so many different processes, so many different ideas that you can investigate in a very small spatial area. You'll be taught two days of human geography, two days of physical geography, and at the end of the course you'll have two days in which you design a project, you collect data for, and you write it up when you get back. It's a fantastic trip because it allows you really to see the way in which the world works and the way in which many of the different geographical ideas that we teach you in the lectures actually operate in the real world. By the time you get back, you know your entire year, and 13 or 14 members of staff also go on the trip. You get to know us, we get to know you, and that sets up a strong community feel to the entire department over your three years of study.